Terry Lumber and Supply Company has been making the cut for generations. My family has been here since the days of the quarry in the early, late 1800s, early 1900s, so we've got a long history here. Take a step back in history as you step into this peninsula landmark. They still use an old-fashioned cash register and believe in old-fashioned values. You come in, you buy a two by four, here's your handwritten ticket. So we like to keep it that way. You keep it simple, it's part of the nostalgia of the business. And you know, we always say we're old-fashioned, so we keep it that way. It doesn't get more old-fashioned than a ride on the Cuyahoga Valley Scenic Railroad. It attracts visitors from all over. And for those who prefer a different ride, like pedal power, Peninsula is known globally for its cycling. We get people from all over the country and all over the world. We have a map in the store of dots of where people have been here from the world. So it's neat to see. It's not just cyclists. The village is becoming renowned for its artists. Two National Arts Guide books recently named Peninsula as a best art community. It really has, and we're just so fortunate to have such a variety of amazing artists here. Speaking of amazing, Peninsula is amazingly beautiful, nestled in the center of the Cuyahoga Valley National Park. With its scenic downtown, more than 20 places in Peninsula are listed on the National Register of Historic Places, a place that some never want to leave. It's a neat thing. I mean, you could go live anywhere you wanted to, but you stay put in Little Peninsula that's, you know, 600 people and, you know, so it's, it, it's a neat thing.